Freight forwarding agents in Nigeria have warned that they will resist the payment of demorage and storage charges accumulated at the seaports in the course of the coronavirus lockdown in the country. The agents say they will not accept the blame for not taking deliveries of cargoes when banks and shipping companies are not functioning at full scale. Ifunaya Eze reports. Contrary to claims by terminal operators and maritime agencies that freight forwarding practitioners were not coming forward to take delivery of their consignment, the agents say they are frustrated over the inability of banks and shipping companies to operate optimally. Members of Nigerian licensed customs agents assembled at the various port terminals to assess the impact of the lockdown declared by the federal government due to the coronavirus pandemic. They complained that conducting business at the seaport has become more challenging owing to several factors that have led to a disconnect in the value chain. Government said that the port remains open and the operative is chained. If you cut one person, the other person is not working. We have come to tell them that we have written to the shipping company and terminal operators, they should see it as a duty to participate in making sure. So many banks and private organizations have donated billions to see that this coronavirus is curtailed. What we are suffering now, they, they promise that they are going to give us bus to bring our people to port. The bus is not available, and the agency on the road, they are disturbing our members. We cannot come to the port. While insisting on waivers for demorage and storage charges, they argued that they are unable to pay customs duty to facilitate cargo clearance from the seaports. Demorage is counting. And therefore, we are pleading that government should be able to talk to shipping, shipping companies, terminal operators, and all the other stakeholders who have input in this business to waive off their charges. If they do that, they are sending wrong signal to the general public because final consumer is going to be responsible because whatever importer import, both cost of buying freight and everything, have to be with the cost of clearing before it's assigned in the general market. They want the Nigerian Post Authority to enforce its directive to terminal operators for waivers on port charges accrued during the coronavirus lockdown. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.